Space Royals. All right, let's go in and let's see what's going on inside of your connection. So you guys, this is going to be a mature Royals reading. Okay, so if you are not of age, <laughs> okay, if you ain't 18, get your get your behind gone okay all right so we're gonna dive straight into this reading you guys um i definitely feel like uh there's someone here right that is thinking about you in a very naughty way okay before they close their eyes tonight <laughs> Okay, so we're going to dive in and we are going to see exactly what they are thinking about. Okay, what are these naughty thoughts? Okay, that your person is thinking about you. Okay, so let's jump straight in, you guys. I want to see who we are connecting with first. Well, first, <laughs> I got to cleanse my area. Duh. All right. Welcome, welcome, you guys. Yeah, I wasn't sure if I was going to be able to make this reading tonight, but I'm happy that I got a chance to. Okay, because I know some of you guys would have been real upset <laughs> with your girl. Okay. Um, the only reason is because, you guys, I was working on y'all a playlist and uh, things didn't go so well. So that kind of threw me behind schedule but nonetheless i'm here <laughs> okay so let's dive into it spirit who are we connecting with i have uh something good for y'all at the end okay at the end of this reading i am going to see what position your person wants to uh uh give it to you in okay <laughs> what position in these positions you guys are not your normal positions okay there, there's 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 some frickalicious stuff in here okay all right so we got aquarius in the house what's up aquarians okay we got scorpio okay we have Pisces, my Pisceans, okay. <clears throat> we got Leo in the house, what's up, what's up, Leo, what's up, okay. Pisces is out here strong, okay. We got Aries, okay, let's grab. We got Sagittarius. Spirit said grab one more card. And then we have Aquarius again. Okay, Spirit said grab another card. All right, Spirit Virgo. Okay. All right. <clears throat> Let's dive straight into it. What's going on? Why? Why are you on your person's mind? Okay, what are some of the nasty things that they are thinking before they close their eyes tonight? Okay. What are some of the nasty, freaky things they're thinking about before they go to bed? Let's see. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm. Okay, so somebody definitely smokes. <laughs> okay. I feel like your person is a real chill, laid back person, right? Or you could be. Okay. But uh somebody definitely smokes here. All right. I see cigarettes and I see a lot of vaping. Okay. Um Mm -hmm. I feel like this person, you know, before they close their eyes tonight, you know, they they thought or they're thinking how chill, like just how chill the vibes was um, when you two 
connect right or we're together right it, it was just such a very um a very chill laid back vibe like there was no forcing this right everything just kind of seemed like it just really just flowed effortlessly okay in this connection okay so i do feel like your person is definitely thinking about the chill times the relaxed times maybe they feel very relaxed around you you know very comfortable very at home okay so they're definitely thinking about that before they close their eyes tonight right mm. Mm -hmm. okay so i am picking up that somebody sings as well mm, smoking and singing that ain't good <laughs> Okay, like uh, somebody is a recording artist. Okay, um, maybe this could be you, right? And they, they, uh, they think about how you used to sing to them, right? How you just really used to be in your element, you know, making music. Okay, if the if the roles need to be reversed reverse the roles okay this could definitely be your person your person could be uh in the spotlight here and you know uh the one that sings or or raps or whatever it is that they do right i feel like uh oh okay thank you spirit i am picking up that some of you have someone that is in the recording business and like you go to the studio and you kick it and you hang out and you chill and it's just vibes right just chill vibes and I feel like um I feel like you really got to experience something different with this person you know and this is what this person thinks about before they close their eyes at night okay hmm. maybe you guys have uh did some pretty naughty things in the studio okay i'm also picking that up you know like when everybody leaves or it's extremely late at night because y'all know how it be in the recording studio okay your girl used to sing but we ain't talking about me okay um <laughs> yeah um there's late, late nights in the studio, right? And, you know, uh, there's some pretty freaky shit that can go down, you know? Yeah. Oh, okay. Let's see. What is this? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I just, I see this person just really thinking about um, how busy their schedule is. You know, and I also feel like when they come home at night, right, and they finally take that shower, you know what I'm saying, smoke that cigarette or, or that vape or whatever, and, and they lay down, you know, they think about how hectic the day has been. And, you know, I feel like your energy and thinking about you is what really relaxes this person you know when they think about how you really bring so much peace to their world and their very busy hectic schedule right mm -hmm. i see a lot of delays in this connection okay let's keep going Give me some more energy, Spirit. Give me some more energy. Thank you. What else were they thinking about, Spirit, before they closed their eyes? Tonight. Thank you. Oh, somebody was watching the game tonight. <laughs> Okay, this may not be the same person. This may be a different message. But somebody's person was watching the game. Okay, so yeah, somebody was maybe having a few drinks as well. Okay, this could have been a party, like a game party. Okay, that your person had. Right. Um, mm, okay. 
I'm also picking up that um, when your person lays down, right, before they close their eyes tonight, you know, they're definitely going to think about how they really mess things up with you, okay? They have a lot of regret about this. You know, they they feel really, really bad and they know they, they really mess this thing up, right? It's like they probably couldn't have did a better job at screwing this thing up, you know? But your person knows, you know, they, they, they know how bad they messed it up with you, okay? Oh, this is definitely, definitely your crush, okay? This is this for some of you. This could be a crush that you had a crush on for a very long time. And, and you actually ended up giving this person a chance and they broke your heart. And this is why they feel bad. Right. Because it's just like, you know, it's almost like a why do we even take it there? You know what I'm saying? If you were just going to do this, we would have been better off just friends, you know. OK, so I definitely feel like that's going to be on their mind tonight. OK. Give me some more energy, spirit. Give me some more energy. And we're going to get into some juicier cards, okay? Mm -hmm. What are they thinking about before they close their eyes? Oh, spirit is saying that somebody is in their feelings. <laughs> Look at this. Oof, somebody is definitely going to be in their feelings before they close their their eyes tonight you know what i'm saying um maybe for some of you if if your person is in the music industry you know they're going to listen to a song that is very near and dear to their heart you know um every time they listen to it they think about you you know um i would not be surprised you guys if you have a very emotional person okay um this person may uh, shed a tear or have shed a tear thinking about you, okay? Because if you look at this, look at this. Somebody somebody has a very emotional person that they're dealing with. Y'all see this? How these two divine masculines are like got their head down. You know what I'm saying? It's like... <laughs> It's almost like they're crying, right? Like they want to cry about something. Like they want to let something out. You know, like they really, really feel bad about something here. Okay? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I feel like uh, this person definitely thinks about uh, how you spoiled them, right? How you really gave them the world. How... They really didn't want for nothing when it came to um, to anything. You know what I'm saying? Like you were literally the one that uh, wanted to do it all for them. They were very, very spoiled, right? And and they think about this and, and they miss this a lot. Because <laughs> I don't think they get this type of treatment from anybody else, honestly. Okay. Mm-hmm. Or maybe, you know, for some of you, this person just really wants to spoil you in a very, um, in a very edible way, <laughs> if that makes any sense. You know what I'm saying? Like, like they want to bring cakes and cookies and candy to the bedroom, you know, and, um, like y'all really just kind of pig out and, and have fun with the food in ways that you've never had fun with food before okay it's also what i'm getting okay give me some more energy spirit please give me some more energy give me a few more cards and then we're going to move over to this other deck okay what are they thinking about before they close their eyes tonight spirit right mm. <laughs> So I feel like your person already knows that you know about something, okay? That's what they think about. They they think about, like, uh, the fact that you're very intuitive and you already know 
the tea baby like it, it's like they can't hold anything away from you you know they they can't hide anything away from you okay let's keep going spirit what are they thinking about before they close their eyes oh mm -hmm. uh-huh <laughs> okay i feel like for some of you um this person may be guarded you know, and, and I'm not sure if you have blamed them for things that they haven't done, but they're definitely standing their ground when it comes to something here. Okay. Um, maybe you falsely accuse them of doing something, you know. Um, yeah, they're like, ah, I ain't about to take the rap for that. You know what I'm saying? And then again, you know what I'm saying? This person could definitely be showing up in the bedroom like this knight in shining armor. You know what I'm saying? I feel like um, I feel like this person, this is how they want to show up for you. You know, it's, it's like uh, they know that when it comes to intimacy, you know, that, that this really... Um, is something that catches you you know what i'm saying every time and it's like this person wants to come in and rescue you with some good love making you know what i'm saying like really put it on you you know mm -hmm. yeah it's it's, it's like um almost like a fairy tale right like this person wants to come running in and, and it's like they want to save you with like this love story okay is what i'm getting wow <laughs> wow okay and mm -hmm. okay this person also thinks about a copycat that wants to uh either be you or be them okay y'all put that where it goes Okay, because there could definitely be somebody in your energy that is trying to be like your person, right? Like your divine masculine. Or there could be somebody in your divine masculine's energy that is trying to be like you. Okay, so we do have a copycat out here. So this is also what they're thinking about, right? Or what they're going to be thinking about when... Uh, before they close their eyes tonight. Okay, give me one second, you guys. <clears throat> excuse me oh so good okay somebody likes wine as well even though there's not wine in my glass you guys i drink everything out of a glass like <laughs> you know i don't know it just makes me feel good okay let's get into this deck spirit let us let's get into this more juicy energy okay <clears throat> what is the juicy energy what is this person going to be thinking about before they close their eyes tonight spirit what are they going to be thinking before they close their eyes tonight Ooh. <laughs> Okay, so somebody's definitely uh, thinking about getting a room with you. You know what I'm saying? Maybe this is something that you guys used to do on a regular, you know, go grab a room. You know, maybe um, <clears throat> it was just to kind of maybe get away from the kids for a minute. You know what I'm saying? And really give you time, you, you guys time to really kind of just let your expressions come out right right like if you haven't yelled in a long time divine feminine you know what i'm saying at least you can go to a room and get that shit out right <laughs> you know you're like Shh, i need to yell you know and I, I i need to moan and i need to you know really give my divine masculine some nice good sounds right in their ear okay so i definitely see um, this being a thought on your divine masculine's mind, okay? Getting a room. 
Okay. Let's keep going. Right. Oh, okay. Wow, that's a heavy thought, right? This person before they close their eyes tonight. You know what I'm saying? Um, they think about how uh, they talk to their mother about you. Okay. Now, this isn't going to be for everybody, but for the ones that resonate with this, you know what I'm saying? It's it. This, you guys, definitely tells me that this isn't just uh, any type of connection. Okay, because if anybody is talking to their mother, a mother about you, okay, uh, this, this connection really means something to this person. Okay, so yeah, this is, this is definitely, I feel like your person, they, they, they think a lot. Okay, this is a thinker. <laughs> this is a thinker. And, and this is somebody that you know, they, they don't just think about one thing. They think, they think about several things, right? It's just so much going on in your person's mind. Okay. Let's get some more. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I, I feel like, um, you know, this person thinks about how you show up, right? As the person they need you to right at that time you know what i'm saying it, it's like you have so many different uh different yous that you present to your person is is just like they love them all you know um mm -hmm. and i feel like each and every one of one of these different yous have a different personality okay <laughs> But they love how uh, you show up for them in different ways. Okay. They think about this. They think about this a lot. Okay. Let's keep going. Mm. Oh. <laughs> Whoa. What is that about? Can they have some too? What is this? Okay, so. Okay, so you guys, what I'm getting with this, can they have some too, is that somebody wanted to have an open relationship and maybe this didn't, you know, this, this was not something that you were like down with, you know? But I feel like uh, for some of you, you're not, you're divine masculines. Um, wanted to have some type of open connection, open relationship, something along those lines. Okay. And um, I don't think that went too well. Okay. They, they think about this as well before they go to sleep. Okay. Oh, look at this right definitely thinking about you know the songs <laughs> you know i'm trying to tell y'all there's some type of song here or a few songs right that you guys really really enjoy playing you know um while you guys are in the act and I feel like they definitely uh whenever they hear these songs they 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 get excited, right? They smile. Uh they they think about how sexy you are, you know, they think about how you're the only one that comes to mind when this song plays, right? So there's something about a song, okay? Look at the I told you. Look. I love when you say, mm, okay, so somebody definitely has a very sexy, mm. <laughs> okay, <clears throat> uh-huh, yeah, right, I'm hearing right in their ear, you used to do this right in their ear, and they're definitely going to be thinking about that mm, before they go to sleep tonight. Okay. Before they close their eyes, they, they're going to think about exactly 
how you say it and how long you say it. I don't, I don't think it's like a long drawn out, mm, but it's um uh, it's a nice little length. <laughs> a nice little length look at those candles okay so somebody here definitely loves to light candles you know i feel like if it was not your person it was definitely you and um this really brought um another sense to um the bedroom right another feel is something about the candles that really really do it for you and your person and it brings such a sexy sexy environment such a sexy light right to the room um the smell i'm hearing something about a specific candle like a specific smell that it just smells so good right uh some of you, you get this candle from bath and body works okay that's what i'm hearing Okay, let's keep going. Oh. <laughs> okay, so somebody has a toe fetish. Okay, so before this person goes to sleep tonight, right? Before they close their eyes, they're going to think about how, you know, they used to suck on your toes and, and, and how pretty your toes used to look. I mean, you used to keep them jokers polished up, manicured. You know what I'm saying? I mean, they, they were always on point for your divine masculine. And let me tell you something. If your divine masculine moved on to another connection, this person, this person either has ugly feet and your person does not want to put them toes in their mouth. Uh -uh. No, 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 no. I don't see no toe sucking going on over there. Sorry. Okay. And I'm also hearing that you were one of the first that they actually wanted to do this to. Okay. Wow. <laughs> okay. Let's keep going. Give me some more energy, Spirit. Give me some more energy, please. Uh-huh. Yeah. <laughs> So before this person closes their eyes tonight, they're definitely going to think about how they used to eat you and then kiss you. Okay. So this person, okay, your person is not very shy. Okay. I feel like this is somebody that is very experienced, right? They, they don't have no shame in their game. This is somebody that will be like, yep, I suck toes. What? Yep, yep, I'll suck them in front of you. You know what I'm saying? Or uh, you know, I, I don't have no problem going down on my girl or 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 on my dude or whatever you want to say. You know, this is somebody that is not afraid. Okay, <laughs> that's for sure. They're not afraid to be who they are. They're not ex afraid to express themselves right in a certain manner look at this waiting for you to come <laughs> mm -hmm. you know so i definitely feel like this person is a pleaser you know um mm -hmm. they they definitely want you at the end of the day to be satisfied you know and, and i feel like this person does wait on you to come right also, uh, I feel like um, for some of you, you used to go to this person's house all the time and, and they would be waiting for you, okay? At a specific time is what I'm hearing, okay? Mm -hmm. They would get the call in too when you, when you didn't show up on time, like, where you at? <laughs> yeah, they think about this. They think about this before they close their eyes. Okay, let's keep going. What else, spirit? I love when you bite your bottom lip, okay? So somebody has some nice, juicy lips, and they're very sexy, and it's just something about the way that you bite your lip that this person absolutely enjoys, you know? It is... 
it's the lip biting you know when people say it's the lip biting for me <laughs> you know this is what this person would say you know um I feel like you might be a biter as well. Like you not only bite on your lips, but you bite on your person, <laughs> right? You may bite on their chest, their arm. I see a lot of chest biting though. Okay. Let's keep going. Mm -hmm. Oh, see, this person likes to role play. Okay. Like, I wouldn't be surprised if this person was into, like, anime, you know, and they like to dress up as different characters, and, okay, so this definitely makes a lot of sense, this, this, I love all of the different yous, okay, because somebody enjoys role-playing, mm, okay, that's very interesting, it's something about, you showing up as different people turns this person on, right? This is what they think about, you know, this is what they're going to think about before they close their eyes tonight. You know what I'm saying? Like, if they were to come see you, who would you be tonight? <laughs> Comment down below. <laughs> Comment down below who who or what would you be tonight if your person showed up, right? <laughs> would you be a doctor? I don't know. Would you be a witch? You know, would you be a lawyer, school teacher? I don't know. Right? Let's keep going. <clears> hmm. <throat> Look at that. How cute. I love your belly. Uh, a lot of you guys have belly chains. Okay, this is very sexy. This is this is a very, very sexy way to draw your person in, right? And this is what they think about. <laughs> you know, um, they think about how you accentuate your waist with waist beads or, or you have some type of belly ring or... Um, mm-hmm. Or your belly may, you know, have stretch marks in areas that you don't like. Or, you know, your belly may be a little pudgy. They don't care. You know what I'm saying? This person doesn't care. This person thinks about your stomach. They're going to think about your stomach before they close their eyes tonight. So it, this has got to be something that a part of your body that they love, right? They're going to be thinking about it. <clears throat> excuse me right Ooh. okay okay <laughs> right so before they close their eyes they're definitely going to think about how you know they they would love to just smack that ass you know <laughs> okay no matter how big how small baby they 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 still gonna smack it you know, they want to see, they want to see it turn red or, or they want to see that meat jiggle wiggle, uh, you know, they want to see something. Okay. Let's get one more card out here. Okay. Then we're going to go into this position that your person has been thinking about. Okay. This is a position that. They want to do to you the next time they see you okay so let's get one more card out here look at this pulling your hair okay so this person likes to pull hair okay so i see that this person can get a little rough <laughs> okay they get they can get a little rough with it and 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 i think you like it <laughs> okay i i think you like this roughness okay so spirit what position is a person thinking about before they close their eyes tonight? What position do they want to put their person in? What position, Spirit? Okay. Ooh, okay. So this is the position, you guys. Okay. I hope you can see that. 
Uh, this position is called, what the heck is this called? Make, what? The, you guys, this red that they have in this book is horrible. <clears throat> it's called the something flap. <sighs> what the hell does that say? The male mud flap. The male. Y'all, it's called the male mud flap. Okay, here it is again. <laughs> I mean, huh. That's y'all let me know if y'all tried this position, okay? Because this is the position that they are going to be thinking about before they close their eyes tonight, okay? Let me go ahead and grab you guys a channeled song, okay? Yeah, this is the song that's going to be on their mind while they're thinking about this position they want to put you in. <laughs> What song they gonna be thinking about, Spirit? What is the dedicated song for tonight? What's the dedicated song? Okay, here it is. Lauren Hill. Tell him. Okay, Lauren Hill. It's a pretty bomb song. All right, so if you've never heard this song, definitely go check it out. You may have messages in this song, okay, that you need to hear, okay? Maybe maybe there's something about this song that your person resonates with, okay? So, yeah, if you guys resonated with any of this, be sure to hit that like button for your girl, okay? It's the easiest way to support the channel okay and if you would like a personal reading with me all my information is in the description box below all right uh definitely head over to riseworlds.com and pick you up some goodies okay um yeah this is your favorite goddess goddess platinum and i'm out